The Pergamon Museum, located on the island of Museum in Berlin, is famous for the exhibition of monumental ancient works and for its Museum of Islamic Art. It takes its name from the Great Altar of Pergamon, a religious monument typical of the Hellenistic Baroque period, which was on the Acropolis of Pergamon. It was brought back to Berlin in 1879, with the agreement of the Ottoman Empire. A good reason to visit the Museum of Pergamon? I will give you two. First Ishtar, the beautiful goddess of love, the warrior goddess, the astral goddess. She is Astarte, Venus, Aphrodite. Coming from the depths of Mesopotamian times, adopted by Akkadian Semitics, it is a major deity. So much so that a door is dedicated to her in the fabulous Babylon, the Blue Gate of Ishtar, built around 580 BC, on the order of Nabucodonosor II, door that is the culmination of the North Processional Way of Babylon. It is decorated with blue ceramics where bulls and dragons walk, symbols of the gods Adad and Majik. Along the procession pass lions, symbols of power. And then, Babylon. 2000 years BC it is the capital of a vast kingdom dominating the Middle East. The Hanging Gardens of Babylon are among the seven wonders of the world. The huge ziggurat, the blue walls are famous in the whole world known. She is the center of the world. The Greeks and Latins of antiquity witnessed the decline of Babylon, but its prestige remained such that they gave it a mythical image, preserving the memory of its greatness. They celebrate Semiramis and its legendary gardens, they praised her sumptuous buildings and her fabulous kings. And even the Bible celebrates Babylon in its own way, mingling the fallen Babel with its proud tower that wanted to reach heaven, and the glorious victories of Nabucodonosor II over the kingdom of Judah. Ishtar the Divine, and for Babylon the Superb, the Mythical, the Proud, you must visit the Pergamon Museum.